Hey everybody, welcome back to X4 Foundations. Today we're going to cover a kind of basic topic, but important one, and it's leading up to answering some questions I have been getting in some of the videos. So once you do the main, once you start the main plot, there's going to be a point where you need to make a dock, and that's what we're going to cover in this video is making that dock. So the first part of making a dock is getting a blueprint, and this is a new feature in 3.0 but you can see which blueprints you own by going the encyclopedia blueprints and then modules as you can see this is what we own now the uh it says owned and the ones that don't say owned are ones we don't know about so are the ones we know about so we know about the, the parlor here but we don't own it so we own the basic dock area here and the split four dock teep here. Docks are not race specific. Piers are, as you can see. So one's the table split. The other dock areas are kind of normal. If you want to buy new dock blueprints, you can get them at your faction representative. So I'm at this split wharf, and if you see this little guy with the crown that's the faction representative i'm in his office you can talk to it's him good to see you friend go to buy a blueprint go to modules and you can see here the other options now the important thing to know about the docks are what the the, the preamble means 1m 6s means one medium six small 3m 6s means it can hold three medium ships and six small it's actually more than that because the medium ships can be sunk. If you've seen it, the medium ships can be stored inside the dock. So they can store a little more ships than that, but if it's a busy dock and you need a lot of ships going in, they don't magically disappear. So the more docks still, the quicker things will go. So we already have the blueprint. You don't need to be in the sector uh to to do building so we'll go over to our player station which you've unlocked over here and there is a xenon raider causing trouble uh we'll have to go take care of him your player station can't really be damaged though um so that the xenon guy's wasting his time but let's go to plan build all right so this is the player station it has the full 3D kind of controls here. Let's go over to the dock modules. So here's the, so piers and docks. That four dock is really a pier. Piers are used for large and extra large ships. Docks are used for small and medium. You don't necessarily need a pier. However, if you want larger ships to be able to interact with your station, you'll want to make a pier. But for the main mission, the main story mission, you just need a dock. So you just kind of click on it, and it can it'll snap. So it's very nice in that regard. So we can adjust a view and snap it on into place. And it'll cost us one hundred seventy-two thousand to build that. We'll accept the estimate, and then we have to find a builder. So this is what satellite coverage kind of helps with. And this is what being down there kind of helps with. 50K. This guy's far away, but we're going to go ahead and select him anyway. You'll see warnings that you don't have the resources. That's fine. That 172,000 will be will be the resources we spend. And there's no peer on this station. To satisfy the mission, we don't need a peer. So we're just going to go with this. It'll be about 230k to do in total. Confirm module changes. There. We are done. Um, we're going to go head, that, head to our station. Shift D will drop you right in your ship. Ask. So that's always a nice shortcut instead of walking. Alright, let's go head over there and take care of that Xenon ship. Um... And let so it doesn't bother our building. Autopilot. 
Engage. And we will cut over to that. Okay, so as you can see, our dock is building. You get to see it in, uh, you know, a little construction state. Over here Albatross. is the Vanguard. construction vessel. It can take a while to get here, so sometimes you have to be patient. But building has commenced. You can see how the building's going by going over your property owned dock modules. You can see 8%. So it takes, it's going to take about a half hour to, uh, to construct. If you have a SATA drive, you can use that to speed up time. Otherwise, uh, it's going to kind of have to wait. Okay, we are complete. The construction is done. Station. And now we can go ahead and land on our new dock. Docking really request quit. docking permission. Grand Exchange is a weird place to do business because there's all sorts of activity with pirates, with uh, Xenon, CAC, uh, Paragon, since we're enemies with them. It's an exciting place to be. So that is kind of how you build your first dock, especially off of the, the player HQ. I hope it was helpful. If you're new to the game, please feel free to ask questions. A lot more content to come. We got 2 million credits to spend, and I'm going to be you know, buying some more of the new split ships and showing them off. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys have a great day.